I did my speech on drugs and alcohol in our community. Um, having drugs and alcohol so easily available in our communities poses many problems. <coughs> One main problem, of course, is it, is it being available to the youth in our communities. And this is a big problem since our generation is the one that will soon be the adults of our society. Although, although peer pressure is the reason for why a kid may start drinking or smoking in the first place, I feel like the adults should set a good example and not do it themselves, or at least not in the presence of the minors. Because this is the reason for why a child may start experimenting with alcohol or smoking, and in some cases, um, pills, and uh, cough syrup. I, I acknowledge the adults in this situation because this can create a chain of kids, I mean, this can be, create a chain of kids being influenced by adults to smoke and drink. For instance, if the kids in our future generation is influenced by the adults, which would be us, to pick up smoking and drinking, this would just cause the problem to turn into a cycle because we were influenced by the adults in our generation, then the kids of our, our next generation are influenced, and so on and so on. So yeah, if, so yeah, I figure if the adults do something about their use of alcohol and drugs, then this problem will be easier to um, fix. Another obvious reason why drugs and alcohol shouldn't be so easily available in communities is the harm that comes with doing drugs and drinking alcohol. A recent survey showed that drinking alcohol is actually way more harmful than smoking weed. The survey said that drinking alcohol can cause a lot of health issues, such as hypertension, congestive heart failure, cirrhosis, liver, and pancreatic cancer, stroke, and many more health issues. But it was too many to name. Um, while smoking, Smoking marijuana increases your risk of bronchitis and can also increase your risk of anxiety. Um, although there are some benefits to this as relieving pain, such as relieving pain and treating glaucoma, even though marijuana does have its benefits, I don't encourage trying it. A solution to the problem of drugs and alcohol in the community would be setting limits. And what I mean by like setting limits would be like stricter rules on drinking. And um, since marijuana is already illegal, there's not, not much that you can do about that. But overall, I feel like our community will be the solution to drugs and alcohol in our community.